Hey everyone, it's Rob here again with Freestyle Enduro 101. Hey, we're going to do some uh, single track riding today, some tight single track riding. And it's not going to be on this. It's not what you think. So let me show you what we're going to go on a ride on today. Okay, our single track trail ride is going to be on this. It's going to be a mountain bike. Just wanted to show everybody one of the things I do to try to stay in shape to ride these uh, dirt bikes off road. Um, I, I took up mountain bike riding a few years ago, and it's really helped me out a lot with cardio and strengthening my legs when uh, standing up when riding on the trails. So it really helps out a whole lot. Um, it's found it's the most enjoyable way to uh, get in shape to ride uh, motorcycles because it's so much like riding motorcycles. I ride this on tight single track, just like I ride my motorcycle, and I get just as much enjoyment out of riding this as I do riding the motorcycles on, on single track. So I got this bike a few years ago. It's a, uh, it's a 29 inch wheels on this bike. It makes it much more comfortable when riding on uh, rough routes and stuff. Just much the same as uh, like on a motorcycle. You have better uh, you know, tires and better suspension. It makes it more enjoyable. Also I got a, uh, on this bike, it's got front and rear air shocks, Fox shocks on them. So really good shocks. It makes it feel very comfortable going over the rough stuff. So I just wanted to share with everybody, you know, one of the, you know, really good things that you can do to uh, get in shape, and it's, you know, low impact, uh, you know, unless you have a wreck on your mountain bike, let's hope you don't do that. But anyhow, some of the things I did to this mountain bike is when I got this mountain bike, the seat that comes with these mountain bikes, it's, they're real, real thin and small seats. So I got this bigger, more comfortable seat, because uh, when I do ride, I, I tend to ride for, you know, hour and a half, maybe two hours. And the handlebars that came on the bike uh, were straight handlebars, and I got some handlebars with more of a bend, like on my motorcycle, which makes it much more comfortable. Um, also, I put a bell on the bike, and it's a bell that I can turn on and off. Uh, when you're riding mountain bikes on single track, you know, it's, it's pretty much silent. So when you're coming around a corner, you may not know if there's another mountain bike coming around the corner or not. So put this bell on it just to let other people know that here I come, I'm coming around the corner so we don't run into each other. So anyhow, I want to take you guys for a little ride with me today on some single track, and you're going to see how enjoyable this can be. A really good training choice for riding your dirt bike. trails that I ride on. It's some really good single track and uh, I'm on my uh, Diamondback Sortie uh, mountain bike. And like I was saying it's got the uh, front and rear Fox shocks, air shocks, so they really make the ride comfortable going through the roots and stuff. And I can, uh, I can run my air pressure a lot higher because I got such good suspension that way I got a whole lot less rolling resistance. Anyhow, like I was saying before, this uh, you know this mountain biking is a really good choice for you know for getting in shape for riding your motorcycle. Um, I'm not no professional mountain biker by any means, or somebody that races mountain bikes. I just I just do it. You know, for the fun and for the training, and you know, believe it or not, it, it's helped me with riding my riding my motorcycle because um, you really got to choose your lines a lot better when you're on your mountain bike. So this bike, it's a it's a 20 29 inch. Um, people in the mountain biking world they call them call them 29ers. Um, started out with a with a Walmart bike it literally was a Walmart bike um, that I'd bought for my son and you know he, he moved off so I thought I'd get into some riding and started riding it and it did okay for a while to get me back into it and then I started doing a little research and they come out with these new wheel sizes on the mountain bikes called uh, uh, 
650B, which is a 20, 27 and a half uh, inch wheel. And got one of those. This is a Diamondback also. It's just a, you know, it was a just a decent price bike. It didn't cost a whole heck of a lot of money. Um, didn't have front air shock. It just had the spring front shock, which basically just got the job done. It didn't have a real good ride or anything. And then uh, rode that for a while and uh, did a little more research for you know the type of riding and where I ride. And I got uh, I got this 29er. And since I got this 29er, it has just been just so enjoyable, so much less work. I got the dual suspension, and it's you know it's way it's way better, especially for the rough stuff. So, okay, everybody. So this is uh you know Rob with Freestyle Enduro 101. I hope this gives you an idea of how fun it can be to mountain bike and make that a good part of your training regimen. How much fun it can be and it's not even feel like work. You're having so much fun a lot of times. But anyhow, it's Rob out for now and I look forward to bringing you another video soon.